Alright, now looking at these two batteries side to side, I have heard that the company that makes the ones for uh, these Superstar batteries are the same ones that make the Harley batteries. I think the company that I've heard is uh, DECA. And if that's the case, then this one should last just as long, if not longer than this battery here. Like I said, I'm not sure about that date code, but if that is indeed a date code, F17, that's gotta be like the original battery that came in this bike. And this is 2023 and that's a very, very long time. So, um, I'm gonna get this new one in, get it buttoned up and um take it from there but, yeah i mean they damn near identical the only thing really different on this one is the casing here where you know they made it the harley casing but the construction looks to be about the same so, you'll see all right so old busted harley battery possibly from 2017 and with a 2023 battery. 400 code cranking out. So we're gonna kick it over. Yeah, all the juice, baby. All of the juice. So let me tighten this back up and then uh, we'll crank it up. Where's my fuel at? Uh, so we still got we got a little bit of riding to do. I'm going to probably get it down to about a fourth of a tank, and then I'm going to dump it. Uh, well, not dump it, but remove the tank. So, you know, we got some other stuff we need to do to the bike. So stay tuned for that. Uh, as you can see, the sun is falling down. And I'm telling you, this takes this takes this summer as hot, hot as I don't know what, man. I don't know what my. Well, like I said, I got everything buttoned back up. Turn the bike on. We got 12 plus. All the way up, baby. That's where it's supposed to be in. All right, so one more time for the camera. Keep power on. That one that went up to 12, 13. See where it dropped to where the cranks. Never went below 12. That's good shit. Never, never went below 12. All right, what up, good people? Uh, as you can see, we are in the garage. <clears throat> I think you're ready to take the bike out. Uh, we replaced the battery last night uh, with one from that's the Harley battery. Uh, I'll put the battery replacement video up in the card or whatever. But uh, we also had a uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I won't say we had an issue, but we were trying to see uh, what would be best. 
for our setup here. Uh, so we just got the Hertz uh, amp. Uh, sorry, been set up or whatever it needs to be. We just have to hook it up. Before I do that, I wanted to run the gas down some. Uh, and go from there. Uh, that way, when I take the tank off, it's easier to easier to maneuver. You know what I'm saying all that good stuff. Uh, so everything for the amp. But the amp and all its wires and stuff is in here. So, and then we got speakers is going in the lowers, which is these DS18s. Um, I was concerned because those are two ohm, and if I ran another set of those, it'd be two ohms, and I believe it would have tried to bring the amp down to a one ohm load. But on here, it only had the rating for uh, two ohm and four ohm. <laughs> so what I wanted to do was get the actual get some four ohm speakers along with the two ohm speakers, uh, and then go from there. So we'll see exactly how we're gonna turn out. Um, so I ordered the kicker speakers from Volunteer Audio. Uh, it's a lower price point, you know, I'm not doing nothing competition or nothing like that. Just wanted some, you know, decent sounding, but better than the stock. Um, so that's gonna replace the speakers up here. And then whatever I do decide to put in the lowers, which would be the DS18s, then if I do decide to switch them out at a later time, then it's going to be easy because these are easier to access than taking off the fan, taking off the pods, uh, inside the fan, and then doing all of that. So waterproof joints up there. Those are also water resistant, waterproof, and get it put on there. So that's pretty much it for that, man. We're going to go waste some gas. Well, not waste some gas, but gonna go ride burn out some gas and then we'll bring it back and let it sit and then start turning it apart uh those kicker speakers won't be here till tomorrow so i probably won't get to it till like tomorrow after work or hell possibly even later in the week but i'm gonna keep y'all updated as always recording the video and going from there